Since its inception, Bangladesh Army has been glorifying our motherland in national and international arenas. Bangladesh Military Academy, in short, BMA, is playing a seminal role in producing the leaders in army and stands out with the pride and honor of being one of the finest military institutions of its kind. Father of the nation, Bangabundhu Sheikh Mujibur Rahman, inaugurated it at Kumidla Cantonment in 1974. The Academy commenced its journey with first BMA short course in the first passing out parade on 11th January in 1975 at Bangladesh Military Academy at Kumidla Cantonment. The father of the nation, Bangabundhu Sheikh Mujibur Rahman said, I mean, Inshallah, among the Nazbe, a academy in Nam, to the Kin Purvesi, I know. So was a Dunia de Saman or John Kurve, to Brados to Sistikuru, that to Mother Jara follow Kuriazbe, Tawaja Rados Suman Hoy, to Mother Guramare, this is Ati. It was shifted to its present location at Bhatiari, Chotagram, in January 1976. The topography of BMA having the Bay of Bengal on its western side and engulfed by the elusive hills gives an amusing look to its spectators. Upholding the motto, Chiro Unnoto Mamushi, meaning, Ever high is my head, BMA has defined three main objectives. To instill in the trainees the qualities of a leader imbibed with the national, societal and religious values military tradition and dedication to a lifetime service to the nation. To train each trainee officer and officer cadet as a competent infantry platoon commander committed to professionalism. To educate each officer cadet as a knowledgeable university graduate with inspiration to pursue higher education. BMA has the capability of conducting vast and internationally acclaimed diverse training. The Academy is capable of training 1,600 cadets at a time that includes the cadets of both Bangladeshi and friendly overseas countries. So far, 520 cadets of 12 friendly foreign countries have received training from this Academy. I, Officer Cadet Bandara, from Sri Lanka. From Palestine. Tanzania. In the past three years, BMA has provided the most prestigious and efficient academic, tactical and physical training for us. After completing the training from this academy, I will save my motherland as a proud member of Tanzanian Army. Bangladesh is my second home. In reciprocation, BMA sends cadets to the renowned academies of the world, Chinese Military Academy, Indian Military Academy, Nepalese Military Academy, Pakistan Military Academy, Royal Military Academy, Sri Lankan Military Academy, and U.S. Military Academy. Bongobundhu Complex is the epicenter of all indoor training activities. It also offers the office facilities for the wings and faculties. The Honorable Prime Minister of the Government of the People's Republic of Bangladesh, Sheikh Hasina, laid down its foundation stone on 24 November 2009 and inaugurated this magnificent architectural edifice on 12 October 2013. The cadets of BMA are accommodated at 1200 cadets dormitory. Officially, they belong to different companies named after the beef sreshtos of our liberation war. Each company has its separate anteroom and dining hall. Some other important facilities here. The auditorium of BMA holds different programs like social evening, address to the cadets, central classes and so on. With a view to upholding the history and heritage of the academy, BMA set up a museum at the southern side of the parade ground the museum preserves the chronicle of developments and other important historic documents including the national standard conferred by the president and gallantry awards received by the officers of Bangladesh Army.
A well-furnished cafeteria at the ground floor of Bangabandhu complex remains open for the officer cadets, trainee officers and the employees of BMA seven days a week. The officer cadets get their daily necessities like stationery, cosmetics, clothing from the well-resourced tuck shop located beside cafeteria. BMA has a well-established combined military hospital. A new construction is underway with better treatment facilities and care. BMA has a number of firing ranges and a firing simulator to train the cadets on firing skills. BMA Horse Riding Club, one of the clubs the officer cadets participate in besides their regular training. BMA Riding School accommodates a stable having world-class horses of very high bloodline. Horse riding is my childhood fantasy. This unique opportunity is only available in Bangladesh Military Academy as club activities. Today, the training standard of Bangladesh Military Academy is globally recognized. Besides the Bangladeshi cadets, different overseas cadets are also coming to receive training from Bangladesh Military Academy. They are our flag bearers. Eventually, officers commissioned from this academy are serving the nation and deployed all over the world in maintaining regional and global peace. BMA deserves the lion's share of this credit. Cadets of BMA undergo three years ARDIS training. Here, a cadet undertakes a three-dimensional training, military, academic and character building. BMA takes pride in training the female cadets who constitute almost 10% of the total count. The academy has also a set of highly qualified and dedicated female instructors. The formal training commences with the commandant's opening address. Military training is one of the key features to transcend the civilian into a military leader. The cadets report at BMA after going through a comprehensive selection process, leaving behind friends and family. They enter the BMA gate with conviction of crossing the finishing line after three years rigorous training. A new haircut is the first step into BMA training life. The day starts for a cadet at the very early morning. Mile test roping, swimming, fireman lifting, crossing walls, ditches, cadets practicing in tower for the final helicopter rappelling. This is rappelling practice. Through this practice, we are gaining confidence for helicopter. It's tough, but we are enjoying it. Selected cadets for basic para and frogman course on completion are adorned with prestigious para and frogman insignia. Cadets in battle dress and equipment practicing assault calls. Boxing instills a lifelong soldierly confidence. Cadets go for gym training. Drill, being the bedrock of military discipline, plays a vital role in shaping the cadets. Cadets are trained to acquire shooting excellence, keeping the motto of weapons training. One bullet, one enemy is the motto of weapon training in Bangladesh Military Academy. Our prime objective is to shape up each cadet as a standard shot at the end of BMA training. To orient the cadets with different heavy weapons, they are taken to an exercise for a couple of days, namely field fire. To implement cadets' theoretical knowledge on ground, a number of indoor classes and model discussions followed by outdoor exercises are conducted. Some of the important exercises are forced march in difficult terrain, since the very first day in Bangladesh Military Academy, it was tough. We are tough, but it's not impossible. It's a challenge and we are enjoying it. As a maker of leaders, we are really proud to train our cadets 
so that one day they become an officer of Bangladesh Army and they could serve their motherland. Raid. Ambush. Oral order. Major and minor operations together and operations behind enemy lines. To inspire the cadets, apart from the directing staff, senior officers also pay visit to the exercise area. In pursuance of higher studies, cadets undertake academic classes, laboratory works, practice in language lab, library works. From dawn to dusk, and from dusk to dawn, the officer cadets strictly abide by the BMA Honor Code throughout their stay at BMA. An officer cadet, An officer cadet. shall lead a life of, shall lead a life of honor, honor and integrity. And integrity. He or she. He or she. The freshers regularly practice the code in oration sessions guided by the senior most cadet of 1st Bangladesh Battalion. In order to internalize the religious values, cadets perform various religious rituals. In fostering competitive spirit and cohesiveness, cadets actively take part in various competitions, basketball, volleyball, football, handball, cross-country, debate, brain trust, and so on. At the last leg of training, the cadets of final term join various colorful and ceremonial activities with zeal and enthusiasm. Passing out dinner, arts and crafts competition, garden party, gala night. After passing through three years of hard training, the officer cadets are now on the finale of being commissioned as officers in Bangladesh Army. This is the historic moment of their long-cherished dream come true. This is the moment of crossing the podium, a moment of boundless joy. In a trance, they fly in the sky, but the next moment, they come back to the ground. Because they are promise bound to safeguard the sovereignty of their motherland. Because they are promise bound, taking the spirit of their national anthem in their heart. Time marches on. Bangladesh Military Academy stands still with its head ever high to welcome the next batch. It welcomes the freshers to transform them into leaders to serve the motherland 